Hello guys, in this video here I wanted to test my range extender. Uh, I made this basically from a pizza box and some aluminium folium or aluminium foil. And in my first test I got around uh, 270 meter more of range than uh, without it. So I'm definitely also going to buy a more professional or a finished made product, a range extender like this, the same concept, because I can't really travel around with this paper box and it's probably going to fall apart. In this video here, I'm trying to get the Spark to gay to fly one kilometers away from me. Uh, and uh, I bought this in Europe, so I also think the controller got some limitations and uh, because without range extender I'm uh, basically losing si signal uh, between 4 and 500 meters. So oh, I'm just going to take off from here and then fly down here over the trees which you are going to see later. But to get even better range, I'm going to uh, take off, let it hover, and then walk up to the, to the top of my house. As you can see, I'm going to take off here. Then I will have a better visual and I'm going to fly out in the distance. Here. Also, I will be using a OTG adapter and having my iPhone in flight mode to even get a better range and not get any disturbance from the phone so yeah so I will speed up some of the video here because it's not that interesting to look at here I'm standing at the top of the house which is probably giving me bad range because it's pretty far away and you also have a lot of trees in the way so here it's uh, I'm uh, flying in sports mode, so the footage is like really shaky back and forth. So uh, I speed it up because it's really not that nice to look at. And uh, when you are in sports, you also get the feeling when you lose the signal. And here I'm slowing it down, and this is uh, right before uh, everything uh, lags out and most of the signal is gone and here I think I also just stop it and it probably lost control there because suddenly everything got stable but as you can see I got 1297 meters and I uh, also activated uh, the fly home here so it's flying home by itself because when I feel when I turn it around, uh, it uh, also drops a lot of signal. I'm not sure if the range is better when you're going from than uh, if you are faced, if the fa drone is faced to you uh, to yourself. If you understand what I mean, and uh, it's just returning to home by itself, and it was really windy, so it was going around 30 kilometers an hour. And somewhere here I'm just taking over control and landing it by myself. So I would deem this a huge success. I got to 1292 meters. So that is like an in increase in uh, 800 meters. Of course, uh, it's not a problem for free flight, but it's still 800 meters at with the same kind of problem that I would uh, have at 470 meters instead of 1297 meters. So it will be interesting to see uh, to test when I get because I'm going to order some uh, manufactured ones uh, 
to see if they are better because they will probably be easier to uh, travel with and it doesn't look look too professional to use a pizza box as a range extender but yeah it works so if you want a little bit more range and be more comfortable with your drone I would definitely try to make something like this and the only downside I would believe is that it's gonna make the signal a little bit more directional I have not tested it but that is what I think so you have to like try to aim the controller always at the drone but I did it uh, the same thing when I was not using this so uh, it isn't a problem for me but a huge sex success so i hope you liked it and maybe give me a like or something that would really be nice thank you